Hey everyone, it's Austin and welcome back to the channel. It's day 364 on my journey to 2000 where I'll be uploading a video every day until I make it to 2000. So thank you for watching. Thank you for your support. Let's play. So after yesterday's three losses, we're at 1805. Um, I think we've won one out of the last nine games. Um, there's a good chance that I'm just not going to talk at all during this game, so just try to enjoy the music. Play it a bit slower. We'll go bishop e6 and queen c7, then rook b8, rather than trying to force things right away. Yeah, I mean, this is how um, people that are afraid like to play, which is fine. If he wants to be a scaredy cat. Oh, just going to do the best that we can, guys. Unfortunately, my best is just never good enough with the way things have been going lately. Queen there. Interesting. Let's bring the other rook in. Okay. if this move is better now because here here my rook is kind of stuck maybe this move is better maybe just this and this kind of hard to say Let's 
go here and here. Here and push the pawn. That's what I think. Because this gives me the flexibility to double up on either file, potentially. Okay. It's just really what we're doing. up a pawn let's go here and trade queens That's a tricky move. That's a very tricky move. Let's go here. Here we have to go here. I didn't think that... Oh, it's checkmate. Okay. Of course it is. Yeah, yeah, No, I'm actually stupid. Oh. This is a miss. Here right away is best. And if takes, bishop f5, bishop e3. Rook fc8. Bishop takes on f5. Check. If king takes, then we have this check. Let's see one. This is a miss. We have this. And... Rook d2, gf, queen d4. This is better for us, I guess. Very sketchy position to play, but whatever. Um. So this was a mistake. This was a mistake. This was a miss. Rook c6 here would have been better. I just suck at getting attacked. Miss here. Brilliant. Um. Yeah, so let's play another one. Just play normal developing moves, get castled.
Ugh, so sad. So sad how, how poorly I've been playing. Interesting. That's a weird one. Guess he wants to go there. I can just do this. Big stakes here. Pull back one. Doesn't seem great. B5 seems flexible. Yeah, man. Um, I don't know. This move, putting the knight in the center of the board, seems decent. Not great, but decent. Go here and this move now. Just playing solidly. Light square bishops trapped, super trapped. Don't go here. Ah uh, ah uh, ah. Uh. Hmm. Interesting. He needs to go back with the rook, otherwise I win the bishop. I'm good with this too. This is still hard to win though. This is very hard to win. Thankfully, I have seven and a half minutes or eight minutes to try to figure it out. Hopefully, I don't rush it. Let's go here. Interesting. Interesting.
this little bit of imbalance I think is going to help me. If it gets locked up too solid, I might end up drawing on accident. But now he has to move the king back or do that. Hmm. There is just this move. This and mate is the idea. Yeah, I think this helps us. Because now we have pawns fixed. A pawn fixed on a dark square. Okay, let's not hang the pawn. Let's fix this pawn on a dark square. If he comes forward, he gets mated. Okay, that's an interesting try. Hmm. Okay, I'll trade, I guess. Takes, takes here. Alright, now this is where the calculation comes in. Takes, takes here. Here. If I go here, then he goes here. So it's all about going here. 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 I believe that I can sack... I believe that I can. Takes, takes, here, here, here. If here, then here. And you can't defend the pawn anymore. So I believe it's just that classic triangulation situation. Yeah. Unfortunate that he doesn't know the theory. I had a, I had a feeling that, that was going to happen. The funny thing is, I think he could have just came back and potentially uh, drawn. That was weird. I thought that I was going to get stuck in a stalemate trap for a second there. Alright, well, the rest is pretty simple to win. Makes me feel better. A little bit at least, actually earning a win. But when I woke up this morning, I was 1850, so... That's that's tough, man. That's really tough. I played an 84. I had a lot of blunders towards the end. Could have played that a lot more accurately. Apparently, this was my best move.
I have no idea why we would allow this. Knight f5. Okay, I'm, yeah, I'm not playing that. Um, so we just traded everything. Played very solidly. Got into a favorable endgame. This was a mistake. Rook d2 right away was much better. Um, I was pretty happy that I found this sequence. I feel like I found the sequence very quickly as well. This was a mistake. Rook c5 needed to be played. Oops. Because if he played g3, then what? f4, gf here, bishop a8. Okay, this still seems pretty good for us. I think the I think the engine is just tripping a little bit. King f5. Like why why would you let him defend the pawn? Like take the pawn. This was a mistake. If he played king h2, apparently this would have been better for him. Rook d1. Bishop c6. Defending the pawn, h4. Again, you can't come forward because you get mated. g3. Takes. King takes. And this is the same situation, no? I guess it's kind of complicated. King e7. What if we play this? Bishop b7. I mean, it's still winning. I don't, I don't understand the misses. Okay, this was a mistake. Yeah, I, th I was thinking that he could have just defended the pawn. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, this is a blunder. <laughs> uh, Bishop f3. And now you can't defend the pawn. You can take here. Yeah, so. Pretty funny. I, I guess I really didn't earn that win because uh he should have he should have drawn at the end. So I blundered a draw. So now I feel worse again. At least any of these mistakes didn't blunder a draw necessarily. So here, just rook c3, king g2, h3 check, and we win the bishop. This would have been nice. King g2, rook all the way over, bring the king, win the game. That would have been nice. Here, what if you just move the bishop, then we take this with check. Fair enough blunder yeah i was thinking that he would just do this and just like hang out behind the pawn and then yeah this is just a draw but remember that one time that i played against an 1800 that didn't know how to draw this i like did this and he did this or something crazy <laughs> anyway um that's enough for today's video. If you made it this far in the video, thank you guys very much for watching. I appreciate it as always. I hope you're enjoying the content, even though I'm struggling. I hope you have a great rest of your day and I'll see you tomorrow.